back to another episode of Strictly Bollywood with me, Anushka Aurora. Here I am back again bringing you a roundup of all the week's news stories. So let's start. Now, I can't help but carry on talking about Padmavad, whether it be Ranveer Singh's performance, whether it be Deepika's performance, or Shahid Kapoor, or Jim Saab or Aditi Rao Hedri for that matter, it was just a fantastic film. Now, before the movie released, we know that the star cast, they couldn't, unfortunately, due to the protests, promote the movie together or even individually. Now that the film has been released and it has received lots and lots of positive reviews, the actors, they are all doing their promotions, although separately. Now, there was one interview that really caught my eye and stood out. It was an interview of Ranveer Singh with well-known film critic and journalist, Anubama Chopra. Here's something interesting that Ranveer Singh had to say. You know, um, it's a, once I decided to take this plunge, once I decided to take this risk, it's a huge risk. It is. Yeah. <laughs> you know, in, in, in Hindi mainstream, it's, uh, it's about imaging for mainstream leading men. You are pretty much perceived uh, in your real life as the characters that you play on screen. Uh, so it was a massive risk for me. I'm glad, I'm relieved that it's worked out. Did you have uh, to think about it or did you instinctively oh say yeah, yes? I was very apprehensive. And on, on various counts, uh, mainly because when I read the part, I knew that I would have to tap into some really dark places in order to play this character and I wasn't, I wasn't ready to do it at that point, that stage in my life. I was in a happy space. Um, I, whatever darkness is within me, I wanted to uh, whatever had been brushed under the carpet, I wanted it to remain there. I wasn't ready. And so it, it took some convincing. Uh, Mr. Bansali uh, really was insistent that I must explore this part. And all credit to him, I'm glad he was able to convince me because I was scared. You know, I knew that I would have to go deep into the rabbit hole for this. And I was petrified uh, at that stage. As you can see, it is Ranveer Singh and Deepika's third film with Sanjili Labansali. And guess what? I'm waiting for the fourth one. Aren't you? Now, seeing as it's the month of February, of course, it's raining front covers for magazines. Now, two in particular that really stood out for me already is Priyanka Chopra, who is sizzling on the front cover of Harper's Bazaar Arabia. So have a look at it. Doesn't she look so good? Now, not just that, but the current reigning queen of the box office in India, Vivika Padukone, is featured on the front cover of Vogue's Happy Issue. And what a better time to be featured on Vogue's Happy Issue. Now next up, this could be news of the next big fat Bollywood wedding. Yes, I am talking about Sonam Kapoor's possible wedding that could happen in June. So rumours are very, very strong that this is happening. So first I heard that the rumours were going to happen, the wedding was going to happen in April. But then just today I heard the rumours about the wedding in June. Now Sonam Kapoor uh, is apparently all set to tie the knot with her boyfriend Anand Ahuja. Now when this is going to take place, if it is June, it's possibly going to be after the release of Vida the Wedding, which is all set for a release on June the 1st. So let's see. And I also hear that the wedding could possibly take place in Rajasthan or Delhi. So two options and uh, I'm sure we'll be hearing some formal announcement really soon. And lastly, I thought instead of starting the show uh, with a date change in the Bollywood calendar, I would end the show with that. Now, Rani Mukherjee is expected to come back on screen with the Yash Raj film Hitchki. Now, that was supposed to release in February. That has now been pushed ahead to March the 23rd. Reason being uh, because Yash Raj films wanted to wait until exam season is over in India. Hence, they pushed it to March the 23rd. So I can't wait to watch Rani Mukherjee on screen in the movie Hitchki. And I'm sure you can't too. And that's about it from this week. Keep a lock to Strictly Bollywood with me, Anushka Aurora. Make sure you like, subscribe and share this video amongst all your friends. I'll see you next week.